Hey everyone, and we are going to be looking at the upcoming major winter storm that impacts portions of the South, Midwest, Middle Atlantic, and even the Northeast. Before we could get into the forecast, be sure to subscribe to the channel so you won't miss a single one of these forecasts or updates. Right now we are looking at around 6 a.m. today, February 11th. As you're seeing here, we are we did see some pretty heavy ice earlier hitting portions of the South and Ohio Valley. However, if we move forward here to the winter storm we're talking about, you see that system moves out of the area by around tomorrow. It's going to move forward here. We get to around February 14th, Valentine's Day at 12 p.m. As you see, we're seeing a big area of snow over here in portions of the South, hitting Kansas, Oklahoma, New Mexico, and Texas. And this moves eastward and brings even more heavier snow the next day at 6 a.m. February 15th. And you start to see that snow moving into portions of the Midwest and Ohio Valley. We're moving forward even more and you see that snow hitting portions of the Midwest and now moving into portions of the Mid-Atlantic. We definitely could see a pretty decent ice storm here, a pretty bad ice storm if this comes true. Around February 16th when this storm hits the Midwest. We definitely could see a pretty bad ice storm over here in portions of the Ohio Valley. And this definitely could bring an inch or more of ice uh, according to some models. So if this keeps up, we definitely could see a pretty major ice storm hitting some of those areas. We're moving forward even more and that snow moves into portions of the northeast. And now moving into portions of around the New England area. You're seeing very heavy snow around the 17th at 6 p.m. And that moves out of the New England area around February 18th at 12 a.m. Here's the total accumulated snowfall coming from the European model. As start over here in portions of the south, we definitely could see widespread in those pink areas. Up to a foot of snow definitely could be a potential here for over here in portions of the central U.S. Over here, more of the widespread dark blue areas, you definitely could see around 3 to 4 inches of snowfall. And as well as the light blue areas, around 1 to 2 inches of snowfall. Over here in portions of the Ohio Valley Midwest, widespread, you definitely could expect around 5 to 6, maybe 4 inches of snowfall. And more of the Ohio Valley areas, around the pink shit areas, definitely could see easily up to a foot of snowfall. Over here in Pennsylvania, definitely could see as well up to a foot of snowfall. And the rest of the Northeast, definitely could see up to around 10 inches of snowfall. Here's the total accumulated freezing rain from this last system that just went through. And you're seeing up to um, even an inch of freezing rains for some areas. Uh, mainly widespread, um, uh, around half an inch, uh, around three quarters of an inch uh, widespread. Uh, freezing rain. This is definitely a pretty major ice storm that already hit this area. However, if we go forward here to win this um, upcoming major winter storm hits, you can see this ice, more freezing rain, hitting these same areas just a little more south and hitting more of these same areas. You're going to see more freezing rain, which means more power outages, more road issues. So you're definitely, this is going to be practically impossible for travel within the upcoming days and your freezing rain is probably not melting anytime soon here uh, because of how cold it is and you're seeing more freezing rain which is adding on to an, another quarter or half an inch of freezing rain so i'll make it around one and a half inches of freezing rain after these two storms hit this same area and even more freezing rain after that uh you're seeing around another almost an inch of freezing rain on top of that already and over here in virginia up two inches of freezing rain after all of those three systems hit that area so this is definitely going to be pretty bad uh for over here in the ohio valley the south um over here in the northeast the mid-atlantic definitely we'll see a very dangerous ice storm hitting um a very extreme ice storm hitting uh, this whole swath of ice storms over here uh, definitely will see very bad issues with weather and road issues, power outages. There's going to be tons of power outages across uh, all these areas uh, within the next upcoming week. Here's the total accumulated snowfall according to the GFS model. And you're seeing a little bit more up to 20 inches of snowfall 
showing up here more of the central U.S. So definitely the GFS is showing a bit more snowfall coming from this than the European model. And over here in portions of the Mid-Atlantic and Northeast is showing around up to 14 to 16 inches of snow. So this is definitely going to be a pretty major winter storm uh, within the next upcoming week. We're definitely need to definitely I will definitely be doing a live stream uh, covering this winter storm uh, possibly 24 7. Uh, this is going to be very bad winter storm hitting uh, the U.S. And probably one of the worst um, by far this year. Um, but if you want more updates on this upcoming winter storm, you don't want to miss the upcoming live coverage on this winter storm. Be sure to subscribe to the channel so you won't miss a single one of these updates or live streams. You'll get notifications. If you put on post notifications, you will not miss a single upload or live stream. Also, share this video with any friends or family that may be in the path of this winter storm because this is going to bring a lot of power outages and road issues. And let's definitely get this out to as many people as possible uh, to get to make sure a lot of these people stay off the roads. If you are going to be impacted by uh, the snowstorm or the ice storm that's going to be hitting these areas. But anyways, stay safe.